Hi, this is Samantha from D Brown. I'm gonna show you actually how to make a, um, it's called hearty egg burrito recipe. And, um, and of course, so I'm gonna kind of show you how to give you the step by steps on how to do it. And of course, important, you can always have the recipe with you. I like to have it just in case. So, but the first thing we're gonna do is that we're gonna rinse off and we chop our green onions, our green pepper, and garlic. Now I already rinsed my stuff off and they got the green pep or sorry, those are the green onions all chopped up. And then green pepper. And of course you have to get the core out. And so sometimes I just kind of do it from the top and try to go around the core. And then I'm just, just like see like that. And Okay. And of course, I need to, have to make sure I have my trash can nearby because when you start to kind of see, usually there's a steel and I can pick it up. So let me cut it open. Let's see, Get all those seeds. I don't know if you can see that. So we're going to throw those away. So we got all that. Now it's going to chop it up. You kind of want to don't make them very big since they're going in a burrito, but you can decide on how you want to chop them. You also can have different kinds of peppers because there's, you know, like red peppers, orange peppers, green peppers, like we got yellow, all sorts. And then there's even some jalapenos that you can kind of put in there of course that'll make it really hot and spicy so I'm just gonna cut this Trying to squirt me. All right, so I have my green onions and I just chopped up my green peppers. We'll put those in the same bowl because I'm gonna add them at the same time. And one last thing to add to this mixture 
is a clove of garlic. And garlic usually has like some kind of little wrapping around it. it. Comes like in a big bowl. And this is just one little part of it. But you want to make sure you get all the skin off of it, just like that. Now, a way to mint mince it is like take it like this. And of course you can chop a little bit like that. But it's also really easy that if you get the flat of your blade on it and then just push down on it and it crumbles it really well. You might have to chop a little bit more, but it kind of helps with it. There you go. So it doesn't want to. Let's see. Once you kind of have it like that, you just cut it really small. It's called mincing. Up. And you can throw it in the bowl with the green onions and green peppers, just like that. Now, the next thing you need to do, is of course, it's like you have blended it, you get cheese, and you're of course supposed to grate it, but we got this kind of cheese. And then you're actually going to take a can of black beans and you're going to rinse them off. And of course, I already did that with mine. Put the black bean can in there, and then I rinsed it off with the water, of course. So that's our next thing. Now, once we have that done, you're going to get your skillet. And it asks, it asks you to put the oil that calls for, I believe it is a teaspoon. And so, let's get... This going. All right, and so we're going to pour oil in. I'm going to let it kind of heat up a little bit. And of course, as it starts to heat up, you can kind of put your hand over it, you know, sometimes and see. As it starts to heat up, you're going to add your beans. You'll add the garlic, peppers, and green onions. Just like that. And then it calls for the half a teaspoon of um, cumin and then a little black pepper. So you put that in there. All right. Wow. Let's see. I'm gonna cook it for a few minutes until the peppers get soft is what we're looking for. So this can take 
about three minutes. Start to sizzle a little bit. All right, after you get those cooked to, you know, how you want it. I'm going to put it on a plate. This. Ooh. That looks good. Put that over there. Okay, now directions say to kind of like the skillet out. Put the towel. So 
once you've wiped it out, you're gonna have your eggs. And it calls for the last of the cumin, cumin, about a fourth of a teaspoon. You put that in there. You're gonna mix them together. Really good. It says four eggs. I put five just to make a little bit more extra. All right. I think that's good. Now, once you have it mixed, Gonna put some oh, cooking spray. Okay, in there. Then the eggs. That way, it doesn't stick. Okay, and we're going to And we're just going to kind of wait and watch it. Stir it a little bit so it doesn't stick to the bottom. Let's see, kind of get it to where you like it. Of course, right now it's not quite ready, unless you like your eggs like that. A little runny. It's up to you. Kind of getting to the way I like my eggs. Okay. Eggs. 
Because they are the beans and or beans, peppers, and onions. So that's pretty much it. Now you just have to build your burrito. So let's scoot this out of the way. Got a little plate. Get our tortillas open. There we go. Grab one. And here we go. So we're going to put a little bit of egg. Of course, you can put as much as you want. This is your burrito. This is how you want it. And I'm going to put Oh my god. Just like that. And if you open oh, cheese. Don't forget some cheese. Sprinkle a little bit of that. There we go. And then if you want to, um, you can put some like yogurt on it. You could put sour cream on it. If I had some, I'd probably put some avocado on it. That sounds good. So, but there you go. That is the hearty egg burrito with the black beans and the peppers. So, enjoy.